Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be discussing one of my favorite Disney collections. I'm sure by the thumbnail you already have an idea as to what that is. It is the Disney by Coach collection. Um, if you followed along with me for the last, my more previous videos, I have discussed the Petunia Picklebottom Disney collection. Um, and so I have one by Coach that I absolutely adore. And so I figured it would be kind of fun to go ahead and review this one. Um, I also thought it would be kind of fun because my more previous reviews of Disney bags have been for baby. So they've been a diaper bag and a diaper clutch, that sort of a thing. So this time around, it is going to be strictly for mom. So this is what the bag looks like. It is like a, almost like a sage green color, but maybe a little more cream. I don't know. I feel like the color that you're able to see right now is a pretty good idea as to the true color. Um, and then, of course, it has a picture of Tiana in her princess dress that Charlotte gave her, which is just pretty in right before she turned into a frog. So it was definitely much smaller than my more previous bags that I've talked about. So there it's just pretty slim. It has a back pocket back here that is you know it goes as deep as the entire bag and then it also has a keychain on the side that shows let me see if that it's an only it's like a print of it but it says disney by coach i don't know if you can see that it's kind of showing up but it's just an imprint on the little leather tag here so that is pretty much what the outside looks like it also has this um cross body strap and then it's got an adjustable belt to it so that you can, you know, obviously adjust the length as you would need it. So very cute. I really like it for, um, whenever, you know, you're just going out for the night or whatever. Um, I just think it's, it's perfect size. I don't like having a whole bunch of stuff with me. Honestly, the less I can carry on me, the better. So inside it has a zipper, obviously, as you can see. So on this back side. So actually this is the side towards the front. So Tiana is on this side here. But inside there is two card slots. I'm trying to not block the lighting here. So there's two little card slots here so you can just put um, your cards that you will need like an ID or and your credit card or whatever. And then there is the bigger cavity in the middle. And then on the other side where the bigger pouch is on the back there is another decent sized pouch to hold cash or, you know, any kind of smaller items that will be floating around your bag. So it is the perfect amount of storage, in my opinion, for, as I had mentioned, just going out for the night or um, just to have, you know, a single person's thing. It's great for mom. I truly will advocate for that. Obviously, we have these giant diaper bags that we lug around all the time. And so... Sometimes just to have something small with a few of our things inside is really nice. Um, and then, of course, if you have a backpack style diaper bag, you can have this on and then the diaper bag over it or however you want to prioritize your wear of that. Um, but I do feel like it is great. As I had shared in my Petunia Picklebottom diaper bag, um, what's in my diaper bag video, I will link that above if you want to see that. I talk about a how I don't really carry a whole lot of stuff for myself anymore. Um, and so whatever I carry on me, I will put it inside the diaper bag. Um, I do feel like this is a good, um, you know, another good thing that you could carry around with you if you don't want to just have like a pocket for yourself in your diaper bag. Um, especially if you carry more than just like your wallet or whatever, you could definitely fit some sunglasses, some chapstick, um, mints, you know, whatever else that you want to have on hand for yourself in this. Um, and it won't get in the way, as I had mentioned, if you have like a backpack diaper bag, that sort of a thing. So really, really like this. Um, I've had it, I think I bought, actually I was given this as a gift from my mom for my birthday about two years ago, as I had mentioned. So I have held on to it for a while. I wish I could say that I used this at Disney um, on our last vacation. I actually, I brought it with us um, in case I did decide that I wanted to bring it along and, or use it for the night or whatever. Um, I can't say that I did do that. I think that I 
we were just kind of going like doing all the things I didn't really like prioritize like putting any of my stuff in here that I would need um, but I do feel like this would be perfect for like a solo trip to Disney or going out for a nice dinner um, you know whatever I, I talk about Disney because obviously it's Disney themed and um, you know sometimes in Disney World there's so many nice restaurants even restaurants that kids aren't allowed to be in and so um, having like something kind of nice but it's still Disney you know goes along with the theming I think this would be just like perfect so the collection itself <laughs> I don't know if you can hear my daughter she's in the other room here the collection itself did have a Cinderella bag which was a really pretty blue color and then there was also a bell bag looked just like this and it was in yellow um, I do believe that there were other products that did go along with this collection. I'm not sure. I tried looking up to see if they still sell this collection because I'm really, I'm really honestly not sure. Um, I kind of was getting mixed, like mixed signals. I think that what I did see, it's still listed on the website, but it was saying that it's sold out. So I don't know if it's still on the website and saying sold out because they are actually sold out or if they just haven't taken it off the website and just aren't providing it anymore. So I'm not really sure. Um, but I do know that Belle came with, <clears throat> um, her collection came with a clutch and a jewelry box and um, one more thing. I think it was more of like a, I think if I remember correctly, I think it was, a like makeup bag style bag I could be wrong don't hold me to that um, but then I think they also had little wallets um, like wallet slips so it wasn't actually like a wallet that's like foldable it was just like almost like a card holder like what they have in here that also had these prints so I could be wrong I do also know that the Cinderella collection did have a few other bags along with it so there was one that had like her carriage on it and the birds, I think. Um, I don't know. There's a lot of different ones. I think the Tiana one, was, the Tiana collection itself was the smallest collection that they had. Um, but like I said, I, I truly can't remember. It's been about two years since this collection was released. And so it's been a while since I've been looking at it. But if you can still find one and you're interested in it, I highly recommend this bag. I think that it's really great. It's just super cute. It still adds that splash of Disney without being too gaudy, which is something else that I really like because that's something that kind of keeps me away from the lounge fly um, collections is that lounge fly as Disney themed as they are. And they're so cute. There's so many that are so cute. I just, for myself and my personal taste, I can't see myself really like sporting a, a lounge fly all the time just the way that I feel. I know that other people will disagree. They love how much, how Disney it is and all that. And like I said, I do like a lot of the lounge light bags. I do think that they are very, very cute, but I do feel like this is just more my style. It's a little bit toned down Disney, which is kind of the, the look that I like. So as I'm wearing a Disney princess sweatshirt, whatever, I don't care. I, as far as like stuff like this, I really like just, this is the perfect amount of Disney for me. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I'm sure it wasn't like too informative or anything like that. But um, like I said, I don't really know if they still sell these bags or this collection in general. I know that they still have an active Disney collection, but I'm not sure about the Disney Princess collection. So like I said, I did try to do a little bit of research about that, but I wasn't able to find a whole lot. So if you want to know more, I definitely suggest you, you know, look into that yourself. Um, because you might find something that I was not able to find. Anyways, thanks for hanging out with me, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.